Detroit Central High School has been closed since last Wednesday and it will stay closed today. A spokesman for the Education Achievement Authority says the closure was caused by low water pressure. 7 Action News reporter Tara Edwards is live now on the city's west side with more on this. Tara. Well, Joanne, this is the fifth day that this school has been closed because of a water situation. As you can imagine, parents and staff are not happy about that. But as you can see behind me, the school is pretty much empty, though we have seen what appears to be some staff walk into the building today. We're told the problem comes from low water pressure stemming from the city water lines. It has been a problem since May 4th. The Detroit Water and Sewerage Department says they are working diligently with the Great Lakes Water Authority to fully access and resolve the water lines around the school. They say, quote, we are managing our combined resources to ensure this matter is addressed as quickly as possible to ensure the safety and well-being of all concerned. And they also say that they have been working with the EAA to inform them of its findings. And I just spoke to someone not too long ago, and they tell me it's actually not the department situation, but it's the water authority situation. We'll be working on this story throughout the day, and we'll bring you the very latest on later editions of 7 Action News. Live at Detroit Central High School, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News. Yeah, I can't imagine the frustration for all those involved, Tara. Kids, you know, have missed enough school with the, with the walkout for those two days, and now to be out again is just incredible, isn't it?